this is Heather Green. I am a whiskey author and expert, and as promised, I am bringing Whiskey Distilled, a populist guide to the water of life, alive over a course of videos so that you can become a whiskey expert. How does that sound? Sounds great to me. I am all about having more educated consumers out there buying bottles of whiskey. So where do we start? This is it, class one at the beginning. Um, and if we're gonna be true to the book and true to a journey on whiskey, then we have to start with some fundamental building blocks. And for some of you, you're gonna think, well, that sounds pretty easy and I'm gonna shut this off because I already know, and this is gonna be too simple. But stick with me here because these are a reintroduction of the basic um, pieces of knowledge from which we can jump off and really understand the world of whiskey. Okay, so, um, and it's also a question I get um, a lot, and it's also a question people get wrong, even people who think they're aficionados. Are you ready for the question? Are you ready? What is whiskey? What is it? Like, if you were to give it to me in one sentence, what is whiskey? Yeah, that's what I thought. It's not so easy, is it? Um, whiskey, at its simplest, Building block is a distilled spirit made from, another quiz coming up, water, yeast, and, I wasn't looking for bourbon. A lot of people say bourbon, corn, uh, rye, barley, I've heard it all. No, I'm just looking for the word grain, okay? Water, yeast, and grain. Whiskey is a distilled spirit made from those three ingredients. And around the world, we get this incredible cornucopia of flavors based on those just three ingredients. And how does that happen? Well, this is where it gets really interesting and really fun. And this is where uh, we get to kind of travel around the world together. Um, how bottles express flavor is basically a coming together of those three ingredients, but also a coming together of history, of culture, of politics, of economics or money of terroir or the beautiful things that come together in your environment, your physical environment to create flavor, everything. So many things go into making whiskey and this is what makes it a really incredible journey. So what is whiskey? It's a distilled spirit from water, yeast, and grain. And then around the world, there are different expressions of that based on so much more. So if we can give it one big word based on culture, right? So the culture around it. And who determines what whiskey is? Like, how do we know, you know, why, why are we calling whiskey a uh, bourbon here or scotch in Scotland? Who makes up those rules? Well, there are different governing bodies who make up those rules. Uh, we have one here in the United States. It's aptly named, very sexy TTB. These guys are the ones who are gonna regulate exactly what it is um, that we can say or not say on our bottle. And that becomes really, really important when we uh, study whiskey is, is being able to read labels. Um, and then also in Scotland, for example, they have the Scotch Whiskey Association. So they're gonna be regulating what can be said in their bottles and what can be called a Scotch, you know? So this is really important because we wanna protect the parameters. We don't wanna just have anybody be able to create something and call it a bourbon. Uh, this is a very uniquely, uh, very unique American uh, spirit and we wanna protect the provenance of that spirit here in the United States. And then where did the word come from? So this is another little interesting tidbit. It actually means water of life in Gaelic. Now, I tried to pronounce a Gaelic word once uh, about hmm, six years ago, I think it was, and I, I didn't do a great job, and the internet, the internet literally kicked the crap out of me. I mean, I was, I was brutalized. So um, whatever you do, don't look that up. <laughs> uh, but... Uh, so I'm not gonna do it here. I'm gonna show you what it is. I have a fancy internet friend that's gonna um, tell us how to pronounce it. So whiskey started out as the Gaelic word. Ishka baha. Yeah, let's hear it again. Ishka baha. Yeah, that's it. That's the one. And that has been bastardized over time to become what we know as whiskey. So whiskey is the uh, water of life. And that's another little tidbit that I think um, you can use at the bar stool when our bars come back and we're all out there drinking and enjoying ourselves again, which would be really, really nice. Um, and then um, finally, why do I care so much about whiskey? What is the meaning of it? Like, why would I devote an entire uh, career to whiskey? Well, 
stay tuned because to me that is something that I think is really, really important. And it's gonna be the driving motivator behind millions of new viewers and readers and consumers of whiskey because there really is an appreciation that goes along with whiskey and why that appreciation is really important to um, society, to yourself, to your body, and to your wallet is really what it comes down to. So stay tuned, I'm gonna hit that next. Um, and uh, happy whiskey drinking. Da -da -da.